past uh, Corbin Head in a moment. Uh, talky, uh, talky seafront. quiet along the seafront stay considering the weather. See a uh, speedboat out there. Yeah so temperatures reading 19 degrees Celsius and it's October in Torquay England.
side here they do have some canary palms uh, that have been um, been there for a while. They seem to um, to to cope quite well with our um, with our winters. And then the Princess Theatre on the right. Fleet Walk is on the left. There did used to be uh, two of um, Torquay's oldest streets, One Street and George Street, which were uh, old Victorian slums. And before Fleet Walk Shopping Centre was built, I believe there might have been a cholera outbreak down there. in the clock tower. It's absolutely crazy here in the summer. So on the right hand side is a coral is um living coast, which did apparently use used to be a uh, coral island. So yeah, I think Living Coast has closed down now at the minute, but um, but before that it did used to be Coral Island, which was a big complex, hotel complex, and I think there was a swimming pool there. But um, but now it's recently, but it was um, derelict when I was a child. That's in the Imperial Hotel.
Meadfoot Sea Road, this leads down to Meadfoot Beach. Cabin, prehistoric caves. So I did go in there a few few weeks back. Kent's cabin. Quite amazing place to visit. Caves get, the caves are quite vast. And uh, previously home to prehistoric animals such as um, cave lions hyenas and early humans so that's not far from here it's uh, about a half a mile drive from here Patches Rock in the distance, Meadfoot Beach flats at the top. Thank you. 